안녕하세요. 아직은 아무도 안 들어오셨지만 준비를 하자면 가지고 있는 일단 책을 준비했고요. 얘는 도서관에서 빌린 거고 이거는 제가 들고 있는 책인데 색깔별로 그리고 꽃을 되게 자세하게 사진을 찍어놔서 그때그때 음 그때 보고 그리기 쉽게 뭐라 그지 딕셔너리처럼 가지고 있어요. 얘는 도서관에 돌려줘야 되는데 일단 아직은 가지고 있으니까 한번 꺼내봤어요. 얘도 사진이 아주 간결하게 하나씩 나와 있어서 어, 그림 그릴 때 보고 참고하기 좋게 좋은 편이에요. 막 복잡하게 음, 이렇게 되어 있는 사진도 예쁘고 좋지만 하나씩 이렇게 띄어져 있는 사진이 그림 그릴 때 골라서 하나씩 골라서 하기 쉽죠. Hello. Thank you for coming. <웃음> How are you guys? I'm introducing uh, some of my uh, reference books that I'm using. It. Um, borrow. This is from the library. Uh, this is from me. I just I bought it. Uh, this is kind of dictionary <laughs> flower books for me. It's quite simple pictures, but it's so good to use it when I'm uh, trying to choose uh, flowers or um, try to find some specific colors. 그래서 오늘은 플라워를 가지고 그림을 그려보려고 하는데 일단 몇 가지 꽃을 정해볼게요. Uh, I need to uh, choose some flowers first. 어떤 꽃을 해볼까요? Hi, Yuri. Thank you for coming. 여기는 좀 복잡하게 돼 있어서 오늘은 이렇게 I'm trying to uh, draw some wreath uh, with flowers. This would be uh, nice. 얘를 가지고 그래도 레퍼런스를 삼아서 그려볼까 싶어요. First, um, I'm going to put a little I will show you uh, simple drawings with pen, then I'm going to add some uh, watercolors. That is um, another easier way to draw the wreath. 이미 이 페이퍼가 동그라미여서 딱히 지금 동그라미를 그려줄 필요는 없는데 먼저 라인을 잡으려면 이런 판을 가지고 동그라미를 그려 먼저 그려줘도 돼요. 일단 이는 하지 않을게요. 꽃을 몇 가지 정해 본다면 오케이 바로 하려니까 I usually do just with a watercolor, not a, in a pen together. Oh, 
thank you for waiting that. You know, I skipped the Friday one. Um, do the live stream. I'm glad you joined today. Um, so I posted yesterday because today is not a Friday. I thought maybe you guys are uh, expecting Friday live. But anyway, here I here we go. Let's it doesn't have to like perfect scare. Uh, I choose the circle. <laughs> you choose the one side. Uh, you You need to choose the main point. Hi, hello. Thank you for coming. 쪽으로 할게요. 주로 I usually choose the right lower side. Um, because I'm right-handed, you can choose anywhere. 아까 봤던 곳을 잠시만요. section you might uh, want to draw three to five flowers beside together trying to uh, draw its petals, our flower petals. One here, and then next. Doesn't have to be the same size, same shapes. This one is facing up, so I will uh, draw a little bit of the inside flower. Yogi do. And here is uh, facing down. This is facing up. I just line the uh, kind of guidelines for where I'm going to draw other flowers. Also, it could be the leaf guideline. Now it's just a pen drawing. Um, it looks, it's not looking interesting at all, but 
Once I finish the line drawing, I'm gonna add colors and it will change. 그리고 여기에는 This is just my planning uh, sketch. 여기에는 here I'm gonna paint here a little berries. I'm just not used to use a pen first. But I will together. I will just add a watercolor right away. I'll start cook canvas. Mm, I guess so. This is from the Paul Vance watercolor. I bought it from the AliExpress. Uh, I just tried to buy one from uh, the AliExpress because they have a good, good price. Uh, uh, the brushes and I haven't tried the paint paints, but paper looks fine. Uh, and then brush brushes were uh, good as well. This one is from the AliExpress as well, but um, it's like three times cheaper than here, Amazon, Amazon, but the quality was not really bad. 그러면 여기에 바로 If you guys wanna uh, do more sketch here, uh, you guys can do it totally fine you can use pen or pencils but I'm, I'm not I'm, I'm just used to use the watercolor right away <laughs> mm. here today is rainy gloomy day maybe I will use bright yellows for the gloomy day. <laughs> for cheering me up a little bit. Since we have the line sketch, uh, the watercolor is just a hint of the color. is enough. Oh, thank you. 고마워, you're using a Korean. The bottom of the flower, uh, I'm gonna add a little bit of darker color here, uh, the orange in this case. leaves. Here it's a little bit painted, but 
안 그렸다고 생각하고 라인을 하나 긋고 살짝 붙여주는 느낌으로 Sometimes um, without sketch feels more 뭐라 그래야 되죠? Natural for me And then I can make Any other different shapes um, If there are the sketches here, I cannot I need to follow the sketch 그래서 음, 없이 하는 게 I prefer not doing lots of sketch here. Maybe uh, this kind of paintings. Sketch를 sometimes 많이 하고 그려야 되는 그림도 물론 있겠지만, can we make? Without outlines, yeah, I will, I will show you um, without the outline. I thought uh, with a sketch, with a pen, could be easier, but I guess it's not. <laughs> I prefer without sketch as well. Hello, Jubilee-san. Thank you for coming. So see, I'm... Um, I paint uh, kind of ignoring all the lines. But black outlines help things a lot as well. S since I need to follow the, uh, the circle round shapes. So it's kind of gu guideline, but I will use a, a pencil next time. So I can erase that after I finish the work. And I'm gonna put berries. Then I'm gonna wrap it up this one. Then let's do it without the uh, outline. I prefer that as well. Here I have uh, outlines here as well, but Without outline, um, start with a pale color first. Thank you. This is quite really simple, simple one, isn't it? You can do it in the like postcard. Oh, let's do it a postcard. So we can make some cards.
여기 아, 이 끝을 가려준 다음 I'm trying to hide the end, uh, very end of the line. 그리고 Hello, thank you for coming from Finland. <웃음> 그래도 연결되는 라인은 It doesn't have to be a pen. I'm trying to do simple as simple as I can. So, um, I will wrap it up here uh, with this one. Then I will do another uh, flower. Hello. I will do another flower with without outline, just using a watercolor um, in a card. So we can make flower, floral, simple watercolor card. So this one, I will need outline, right? Uh, 이거는 리스지만 동그랗게는 못하겠고 Maybe this one I will use um, One simple shape 여기는 어떻게 설명을 해야 되죠? 음, 그 this one uh, 이런 shape이 될 거예요 so I will put maybe three big flowers in the middle and a little ones here. One up, one down. 그러고 나서는 잎사귀들로 the leaves 를 채워주는 것. So this is my uh, plan for the little postcard. After that, I need to choose with what kind of flower I'm gonna uh, use for those big three. Oh, you mean that this one wing? I just saw one here, um, orange poppies. So I'll choose, I will go to the orange section. Lavender, yes, I will. Um, then I will add lavender, yes, that sounds good. The poppy로 하면 lavender 어울릴까요? Do you think lavender and poppies go well together? The 
purple and then then I will change um poppy colors since I'm gonna do the lavender. Oh you don't guys this is lavender. We're gonna go on the lavender, the purple ones. So purple with maybe like a pink. Pink will be good with lavender. Maybe kind of ranunculus, this one. We love it there. Gonna work well, I guess. Okay. I need to simplify the flowers, but it's always too, it's always better with the reference real flower or picture in my case. So, three, three in the middle. I change the brush, a little bigger one. Lots of water. Only. Here I'm gonna uh, make little white spaces between the petals. And one facing right up. Other ones will go maybe here, but I will use a little bit of pink, pale pink. And between the flowers, I will add dark leaves. 
얘는 이 모양이 This one leaf shapes are not like typical. 좀 특이하게 생겼어요. 더 그린 터치스 플라워스 돈 패닉 이즈 워터 컬러 잇 해프스 어 lot 넵스 투 마치 메이비 그래도 스틸 유 캔 유에이즈 앗 하고 Then, then I will add lavender. Lavender, do. Lavenders are. Um, One, two shapes. So, uh, maybe over here. <laughs> Maybe it's better to see what you like first. The blue over here. It's not fully uh, bloomed yet. Mine is a little fat lavender, I guess. This one goes up, so we'll use this one. This lavender goes down a little bit. This lavender is a little bit different. Maybe this year I wanna uh, visit the lavender farm. You know who like big, wide lavender fields. I saw. I only saw the pictures. Maybe, maybe it's from Europe. Lavender. Oh, 매 가면 벌이 많지 않을까요?
Lavender has a short, thin leaves. There are not many spaces that I can pin lavender leaves here. I have a little lavender, uh, maybe two plants in my uh, front yard in my house. Don't know why it didn't grow that much uh, since it has been like three years uh, I plant them. To, to make sketches, uh, yes, sometimes, um, maybe most of times, but not with watercolor, like this kind of quick painting. Sometimes it bothers a little bit. If I need to paint really, you know, delicate, well planned a uh, painting, I definitely need to uh, do the sketch and maybe simulation as well. Um, how I'm gonna paint, but in this case, uh, in this case, I guess sketch does need to be that perfect and then I prefer not to doing it. Which one goes front? Actually this one goes front. So I will put the other one to back. You know dark color here as well. I put this one goes front. Since I don't do the sketch here, uh, that's why I need a reference book so I can see how the flower look like and then I can what I do not Reference. Yes, it's just reference. I need to see um, how it looks like, even though I'm not painting exactly the same, you know, I'm kind of simplifying the flowers, petals and shapes, but I need to know uh, their structures and so I can, so I can simplify them. It looks a little bit dark. I'm gonna add light, lighter color of leaves. Let's 
얘가 진한 게 앞에 있으니까 베이직 립스 그리고 그랬던 I can always add more um, since I didn't do the sketch. It's a really uh, good point. Uh, I can change, uh, I can add more. Sometimes that makes me do uh, over paint but that's definitely a really good advantage that we do the watercolor um, and without sketch. So I'm trying to make a balance between the right and left. Mm, thank you. Sharma, is that your uh, last name or what's, what's your uh, first name? I guess I can finish that uh, with this one. I don't like um, dark purple here. Um, could be the lighter. Oh, name is Hari. Hari Priya. That's pretty name. 여기에 글자를 적어주면. Here I'm, I'm gonna write thank you. Or uh yogi on you can make some lines over here or uh outlines. 
the card or you can write some thank you notes for the finishing up. 어떤 걸 해볼까요? Here we have lots of uh, good Indian neighbors and my son's friends. I guess that helps me to pronounce the, your name. Here, do you guys want to uh, outline the card or some thank you notes? Thank you, Note again, and Tadi got to put up and go up to go. Maybe small one. Okay. So I will put my name here. It looks not bad. So, here. Little thank you card is finished. Very pretty. Very pretty. Well, uh, what does that mean? Do you guys have um meaning of your name? I will, I will make another one. Because I want to paint really simple, lots of flower filled uh, painting. So here, uh, this one, I'm going to do a little bit of sketch. Lavender, Godness name. Oh, I see. One of my uh, Indian friends gave me an uh, Indian name one time. Uh, it's Kiran. It means, does that mean sunshine? Something like the sun. It's good to have like uh, meaningful names. And I guess all of Indian names have special meanings.
maybe I'm doing a sketch, but it's only um, I can see. So you know, sketch is really simple, but at least I can have brief uh, ideas on how I'm gonna um, do the layouts. Oh, it means some sunshine. <laughs> Karen, yes, I love the name. She, um, had a few name list for me and I choose one. It was Karen. Hello. No, you can always add more. And this one is lavender. That one I will use yellow. It could be the mimosa or just the wild flowers. Oh, and then the reason why I don't why I don't like lots of sketching um before the watercolor, cause the the pencil is black, so I can see through the watercolor because we are doing a clear watercolor, and then that makes paint dull and dark, especially the bright side. Uh, the lighter part so if you need to do the sketch use lighter color or pencil this one I use I use 2H sometimes I use 3H that may that will make your uh, watercolor more clear and brighter and well painted finished one Here, can you see the pencil lines here um, in the yellow dots? Blue, it doesn't bother me, but in the yellow part, the sketch line is kind of, looks bad, at least for me. Hello, how are 
are you? I'm glad that、uh, you're alive, Dodelli, safely, well. Ah,、oh, thank you. I will, I will let you know my address so you can send me the card. In purple, Pudo. There i s many kinds of purples, so this time, this time I will use a little bit of blue, purple. This time I will use our paint in lavender. Last time was kind of didn't look like lavender that much. No, especially lavender, you don't need sketch, you just need the、uh, straight lines, guidelines. Oh, yay! How was West Bengal? I've never been there.、Um, is that Is a kind of like vacation area, you know?、Uh, it's southern India, right? All of the eastern side. Eastern side. It has a Calgary there, the eastern side. Anyway,、uh, I'm glad that you're back. <laughs> I still can see the、um, black lines here. Trying to hide it. I will add some orange shade. Not too much. Mm -hmm. No, you can speak Bengal. Is there many? 
is that a lot different from the Indian uh, in you're using it in Delhi? Lavender toka. I'm trying to do the lavender first. Really thin. Toka jimenandeo. to be, try your best to draw a thin line. Oh, it was too thick. Sorry, sorry, I do. there are a lot of languages but 22 seems a lot the similar language that you can at least understand a little bit Maybe uh, similar words. I like this one a lot. I'm not sure you guys can hear the sounds. Uh, my neighbor is fixing their house. So it's a little bit low. I'm going to add some flowers over here.
still like them. You mean the um, the lighthouse one? I saw the Instagram. Oh yes. Uh, if I wanna give you some simple tips. Here, um, I use deep color over the lighter one, so make the points. So you can, your painting was well mixed uh, colors all together. And then you can add a little bit of points with a dark, darker color. You choose really small spots so that will give uh, your viewers to see the point in uh, in the lighthouse painting you can add darker colors on the lighthouse and a little bit of the seaside that would be um, if I want to give you a tips then um, after you finish the whole work try to put a little bit of dots maybe with a darker color oh Oh, posted a new one. Oh, Japanese writing. Oh, yes. Oh, that was Japanese writing. <laughs> Thanks. You mean the color is blended and then you write something, right? Oh, that was Japanese. Yes. Mm, that one, that one I... I cannot give you tips, but uh, the color was good. You know, the green, the one that you have the icon in it now, right? The green and blue shade. Yes. The color mixture was good. The greens and mint and greens, blue. You choose the right ones. Oh, that was Ghibli Garden of the Words. From its movie. Um, you guys should see the movie. No. I guess I haven't seen that one. Write the good movies here. Uh, then I will I will watch that. And I have the time. Then maybe I can paint a little bit uh, from the scene. I saw lots of people drawing uh, Ghibli studio paintings. I guess Kiki, the uh, witch, right? I guess I saw that one. Not sure, uh, Whisper of Heart. Uh, 
I'll, I'll watch that anime animation one someday, someday soon. <웃음> 여기 꽃 하나 그리기로 했는데. 바닥에 있는. And then I watch the How the Moving Castle. I love that one. Yeah. Lullaby, you mean the song or is it from the Ghibli studio as well? Do you think uh, it's enough? You can feel the flower field. Maybe I will add a little bit of green hues. When I make, you know, more of these, um, just today we made the two, two little cards. I will send, I will send it to you. It sounds good, right? This size of uh, card is way easier to start one. This size is how much? This is three, three 
by four. It's on the three by four color. I use a five by seven uh, in the Christmas card. It was quite big. So I bought a smaller one. I um and then I kind of like get the smaller one. Thank you for joining here today. Um, I really enjoyed that as well, talking to you and then doing the lavender. I love lavender too. Oh, maybe a little bit of. If I have chance to visit the lavender farm this year, I definitely uh, upload the video. Oh, thank you. The vlog took a lot, lot, lot more than just editing video, but I'm glad that you guys like it. Oh, Christmas card. Yay. <laughs> thank you for joining today. And then I guess I'm going to see you guys on next Friday, maybe, or, or Thursday. Uh, I, will, I will post the notes. Thank you. Have a great day. If you uh, guys are paint, uh, you can upload the Instagram that I can see. Bye.